Hey guys, what's up? ScreamKid11 here today. And today I am unboxing a Rudel West German Clown. That's right, um, I picked this up as an import. Um, so I didn't have to, I had to pay double to get this thing here, but a uh, Rudel is a little sketchy because you'll have to wait. It could either be like two weeks, two months, and you never know if you're gonna get a good piece that's painted very well or if you're gonna get a bad one. So I decided just to buy this import piece. Um, so it's still the Rudel Clown. Um, so yeah, let's hop right into it. This is the first Slipknot mask I ordered. Um, I actually ordered a BCD also, which will be here soon. I can uh, cut this box here. I don't want to damage anything on the inside, so it's trying to be cautious. And I believe I can see the hair on it. Definitely excited. Yep. Oh wow. Oh wow, these things are really tough. Vinyl is definitely a tough material. Huh. Oh wow. Oh man. Absolutely beautiful. Look at that. That is beautiful. I'm trying to show you guys all the detail. That is amazing. It smells good. It smells like good vinyl. Um, it's very thick. Uh, I don't know how well you guys can see how thick the casting is. Look at that. That's pretty insane. The hair is quite long. Um, so yeah, I'll go ahead and throw this on for you guys. Very tough. So yeah. So it's a little weird to put on. Um, but that's all right. There's a big piece of vinyl um, when you put it on. So I'll try and show you guys the inside. But there's um, right on the eyes. There's a big piece like of. There's a big part of vinyl where those uh, eyes are. So uh, be warned when you put it on. It's a little awkward the first time. Um, but I mean you'll get the hang of it. So the mouth is cut out. I never knew if the mouth was cut out or not. Now I know the mouth is cut out on these. This thing is just absolutely insane. The paint is pretty pretty good on this thing. Um, the mouth could be a little better. The teeth look messed up, which I like. So, the teeth look pretty messed up. They're kind of gritty, um, which is nice. The You know, the paint in general just looks very airbrushed. It's very nice. Um, I like the airbrush style. Um, it's just really, a really great piece. So I'll put it on one more time. Um, I'd say these are probably fathead friendly. Uh, I'd, I'd say probably. So put it on again for you. They're very thick. Um, so when you put when you put it on, it'll stay on. But getting it on is a little awkward. So yeah, that is a really amazing piece. Um, I paid about one, about one ten on this thing, which is pretty nice, um, considering just the quality of this mask. Um, it's a full head piece. It is very sturdy. Uh, I don't think you could really rot these things um, naturally. Like it would take a very long time for this to rot out. 
um, considering how thick it is, um, and vinyl doesn't rot that easy. That's why a lot of ghost face masks, um, let me just grab them for you here. This is vinyl, um, these don't rot, like, ever. They barely will ever rot. I'm gonna tell you right now, this vinyl smells good. <laughs> um, I do like the smell of vinyl. It's very nice. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, the hair runs all the way to the back, which I also didn't know, but it's definitely an added plus. So yeah, I'll put it on one last time, just in case you guys weren't able to see all the detail. So yeah, uh, that thing's really amazing. <laughs> um, that's all I can really say. I mean, it's a beautiful piece. Um, this is definitely, I'd say, probably my favorite piece I own now. Um, I'm trying to go for a full self-titled set. Also, just so you know, this thing does have ears. <laughs> it does have sculpted ears on both sides. Just the hair is put on there, so you can't really see them adds that extra detail um, but yeah so like I said the next Slipknot mask I ordered was a BCD um, a British civilian duty um, gas mask that Sid Wilson wore um, kind of converted um, with leather straps the mouth was taken off and the lens uh, and the eyes were taken off so I'm gonna be um, having that I'm gonna take out the lens in the um, mouthpiece the filter and then uh, I'm going to send it to a friend um, I'm trying to work it out with Trait and Biglow, um, so we can, uh, I can get that thing strapped. Um, so I'm pretty excited about that. I'll definitely make an unboxing and a whole conversion video on it. Um, but yeah, this thing is amazing. <laughs> There's nothing else really to say. It's a beautiful piece. The paint is absolutely wonderful on this thing. Um, it's a little sticky. The paint is. That's alright. Um, as you can see, there's a whole lot of color on this. Um, immediately, the first things that'll pop out is the yellow, the green, you know, the purple, the red, the blues, the white. Um, there's, it's all just blended in, and it makes this really good-looking mask. Um, that's all I can really say. It's just really, really wonderful. <laughs> um, so yeah, um, I don't know about advising to buy from Rudel. Um, I, I don't know. It's weird. Um, I would buy an import, honestly, or just buy one off eBay, um, because I, I honestly trust eBay more. <laughs> I trust eBay more than anything, honestly. Um, so yeah, if you're going to pick one up, probably just buy an import. You won't have to wait as long, and uh, you can usually get a guarantee that you're getting a good piece. <laughs> um, so yeah, that is the Rudel. West German Clown Mask Unboxing. I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. If you guys want to see more uh, little unboxing videos like this, let me know in the comments below, because I do enjoy doing these unboxings. I think they're very fun to do. Um, so yeah, let me know if you like them. If you like more content, um, all like this, horror related, mask related, whatever you could really think of, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Um, and check out the previous unboxing from the House of Masks. Um, and yeah, like I said, I've got more unboxings coming up very soon. I've got a lot of stickers coming, so I'll probably do a big unboxing video. Of all those stickers, I ordered House of Masks stuff and stuff from the Museum of Random, which I'm very excited about. And of course, the BCD is coming in soon. So yeah, I will see you guys later. Definitely pick this thing up. It's amazing. See you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.